So I can just drag the the right uh, logo for band three. I've got to resize it again. Three two thirty and drop that one in, and also the gallery image. Okay, this image is the wrong size. I'm going to change the size and crop the canvas size as well. Okay, so that's the gallery image for this one. Okay, and the just in the right place and collapse that group. And the last thing to do is to um, duplicate group for group four. Rename it group four so I know which one it is. And then just I'm using the arrow keys just to shunt this one down. There we go. And just like the other ones, I just open the group up and uh, delete out the images and put the new images in. So band four logo, resize, drop it in and save it. And the last photo album image, let's just resize that. Drop it, drop it in. That's good, don't save it. Okay, so those are the four bands, almost finished. Let's get rid of the wireframe, see what it looks like. And the bridge, there we go. Um, okay, so the last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put uh, a little bit of uh, footer text so I'm going to go to Vedana, grab a white, and put some copyright information in, 2000X, high res records. I'm going to also have a privacy policy link, find that on most websites, terms and conditions. Okay, I'm also going to put a copyright symbol in here. Zoom in. Now if I press uh, Alt and 0169, there's the copyright symbol. I'll make that uh, regular. And uh, that's what my web page is going to look like. I'm just going to change to somehow that's turn white and put it back to black again and rename these obviously this is band 4 okay do it again band 4 band 3 And we have, and I'm pressing F just to see what it looks like in full screen mode. So you can see uh, that's what the website looks like, the mock up of it anyway. Now I can save for web and save it as a PNG file and share it with the rest of the web design team.